It was the first library in all of Canada built as part of a condominium 35 years ago. The Dawes Road branch in the Taylor Massey community may not be that big, but the eight living spaces above it are home to some. Unfortunately, not for much longer. They're going to create a bigger library, a bigger community centre, but they're not putting any housing above the library in the community centre. And this whole neighbourhood, this stretch along Dawes, is zoned for apartments. The plan to tear down and replace the library dates back at least 10 years. And after neighbourhood surveys and meetings, now includes a much larger facility, including a 5,000 square foot community hub to include social services. Great news for an area in need, and yet questions continue to arise about the actual loss of housing rather than taking advantage of the opportunity to build more. City staff saying, you know, we've lost housing on this site. How do we replace so that through, housing or put housing somewhere else through, through the to chair, replace it? Specific to this site, we're talking eight units, I believe, and, and one house is, is my understanding. Uh, based on, on what we're working on right now. So throughout, and there are a variety of different programs to actually, you know, build stock within, within the city. The city's housing TO action plan announced a couple of years ago set a target to approve 40,000 new affordable rental homes over the next 10 years. A tall order that is otherwise starting to take place. Could this not be an opportunity to try and build more? So I think we should always be looking for opportunities to look more. We have to stop the silo mentality. It makes perfect sense. We need to look at it at every opportunity that we have. This is apartment zoned land. The city has a housing crisis. Uh, lots of other places, even places in the city, we're building a library and we're building rental housing above it, but that's in a private sector development. In the Junction Triangle, a new 14-storey building is under construction. It will be home to 236 rental units, retail space, and a new library branch. Proof that it's possible. I think there's the, that we're going to be looking at that. This is something that Creatio will be looking at. I'm sure that it's going to come to the board as well, and we're going to be able to give them feedback. Another public consultation for youth in the community was scheduled for Monday night. Site plans and designs are in the works and construction is expected to start in 2023. The current library branch will close once that work begins. Mark McAllister, City News.